Hey guys. So, if you didn't know, which obviously you do because unless you live in Australia, um, school's about to start. And today, I am doing the first thing to prepare for the school year, which is back to school shopping. I'm gonna go get school supplies and then come back and give you guys a haul. So, yeah. Let's get into it. When I grow up, if I'm rich, I'm gonna have a nice truck and a Tesla. Oh. That's what I want. Please don't say it's a Tesla truck. No. Okay, good. Oh. Alright, guys. It is 9 30 the same day. I went to a Great Wolf Lodge for somebody's birthday. It was a lot of fun. My little six year old cousin. So now I'm tired, but I want to do this because I'm oddly really excited for the school year. So if you did not know, I'm going to be a senior this year and at my school seniors in a lot of Texas high schools, I know, I don't know about other schools though, do the children's backpack kind of thing. So like the seniors have backpacks that were like with your last year of school. So like flashback to the first year of school and in kindergarten. I was obsessed with One Direction, so I thought that this would be the perfect backpack for me to use. So I got a One Direction backpack, and I'm so excited. Oh, guys, like, you don't understand. I'm excited for this backpack. And then I'm planning on bringing my lunch a lot more because it's like, I don't know why I did last year, but like, I would only get a bag of chips and like a Dr. Pepper for lunch every single day. And it was really bad, like, for my health. And I want to get better about that this year. So I got a lunchbox and to stick with the trend of children's stuff, it's not one direction. I got it at Target today. I got a Spider-Man lunchbox and I'm like, actually like guys, this is so, this is so awesome. So yeah. So we're gonna pack my bag up and I don't have much. I really did not buy much this year. Just throughout the years I've realized that I don't actually need many things. There is one thing that I ordered and it's gonna get here tomorrow so I'll show it to you guys. It's just a pencil bag so I can't exactly put in like my pencils and stuff. I can show you what pencils and like pens I'm bringing. But first I'm gonna start with journals. The last two or three years I've brought a three subject notebook and then a one subject because there's always that one teacher that's like leave it in the classroom. It's kind of annoying. So I just got a plain black one. The first one I saw honestly. And then I got the five star three subject. And I literally think I had this exact same journal for sophomore year. So, those can get thrown in here. And then to stick with the purple theme, I got a purple five star folder. I love these folders because they're literally so like handy and like thick. Like they don't get ruined very fast. Last year I just got like one of those, um, I don't, want, I don't think it was paper mate. It was like some school supplies brand it was pretty cheap and I was like whatever and it like ripped halfway through the year so now I'm gonna go with a five star this is just for like homework assignments because like, I handled a lot of papers oddly enough and then I don't know if I want to bring this entire thing I don't think I will just because it takes up so much room and I have like, kids backpack so we're gonna skip that for right now then I've got just post-its and index cards you never know. It's better to be safe than sorry. Boom and boom. Actually, I might. I think I might put those in this pocket. But. And then I'm gonna. I got a pack of gum, the best flavor, the polar ice. And then just tape. I don't even know if I'll need that. It's in here for now. All right. Now let me pick out what colors I want for my letters. The gray. A yellow. So I'm gonna bring these four mild liners yellow, red, green, and gray, just because I feel like I've used those a lot. And then I have these three Sharpie highlighters. My brother bought a whole pack today, so he could just choose some, and I chose the girly colors because I don't think he would want them. So these are the highlighters I'll be bringing this year. And then these are like some of the best ones. My favorite pens are the G2, but my mom wore the Lexi, so I was like, we can just get those. It's these Sharpie S gel pens. I used them the last few years as well. They're pretty good. Then, I don't know why I'm bringing this pencil. I don't ever use pencils like this, but just in case, and one of my students got it for me. It's like those bending pencils. 
a red pen because I only have black pens and you never know. There's always that one teacher who's like so strict on it. It's so stupid. And then I still have these from last year. I used like 10 pencils total. So I'm just going to grab like a bunch of different colors. Okay, four pencils. That's all I need. And then I'll get that bag tomorrow. in here and then I think let me see if I can fit my lunchbox let me get the stuff out of here oh there's one more important thing I've got to bring my school issue computer we have the same one since sixth grade so that's gonna just go in there and then you can never forget aqua for I think I might put this stuff into the pencil pouch because I think you'll see the pencil pouch tomorrow now let's see if everything fits. It does. Okay, and then there's one more very, very, very important school supplies item. And I've this is the first year that I've actually like I'm doing this. Oh, <laughs> I'll get to this in a second. But it's gonna be me, and my little brother. And he doesn't drink these a lot, but I do. And instead of going to the donut shop, which we'll probably still do, to get a drink, I bought a 15 pack of a monster. This will go in the fridge in the garage where school starts. I don't want anybody taking them until then. And I have to warn my older brother if he takes one, I will get very, very mad. But I'm going to continue this video at least until tomorrow. And then whatever else, maybe like my hair. I don't know, we'll see. Okay guys, so it's the next day. I'm actually at my elementary school right now, volunteering and helping out, like, get wrapping up these, like, not wrapping up, putting these gifts into, like, little bags. It's their, the teacher shirts, their jerseys, and the thing this, um, Team Green Journal, and I'm looking at the poster that I painted. <laughs> but I'm making these little bags, but I got a little notification earlier today that my schedule comes out at 5 p.m. today. It is 1.50. I'm going to leave here around 2.30, 3.30 maybe. I've been here since 10, so. Um, but the thing is, I'm going to see it into the bus with my friend at 4.30. So clearly, I'll still be in the movie then. And that's about when the movie's starting. And I'm not going to look at my schedule during the movie. Because I want to, first off, why would I do that? I'm excited for this movie. Second off, I need to get my reaction to it. Like I have done the last few years. That's basically what I'm doing. I got injured with staples. It was fun. See you guys later tonight. I finished every single bag. And they're sorted by size, as you can tell. And now I have to do name tags. Okay, I literally just walked in. Now let's open some packages. We've got two of them. I don't one of them came in a clear package. I honestly just looked up pencil pouch on Amazon and ordered one that looked handy. So it has some pockets. Let's see. Okay, so that makes it wider. This is and this. So let's go put those pencils in here. Let me grab them. And now for the package we have all been waiting for. We all means me. So I'm gonna tear off the sides of this. I can't show you the back of it because it has my address on it. Alright, let's try them on. And I'm boring, guys. I'm so boring. I got the basic ones. Only because I want basic ones and then I can get the like colored ones, like cute colors. Which I like the navy. My mom almost bought them yesterday, but she did. Okay, I'm gonna try these on. I'm gonna blast take off these that I already have on. Cute. Alright, I'm gonna wear them tonight, but I need to plug in my phone, so. Okay. I told myself I was not gonna look at my schedule until. I got home from the movie, but my best friend was working whenever I got off, like, out of the movie, and she was like, no, you're looking at it right now, and let's see if we have anything together. So I did. It was that. It's just friendship. 
but I know my schedule. I don't know it by heart, but like I know what classes I'm in. And right now nothing's messed up on it, so they shouldn't be changing it. All of my friends have had to like get their schedules fixed before school starts, but I've never once had to do that. They always get mine right, so because I get to my I, I get it correct whenever I signed up. Why is that conflict not turning on? I know my first through third period, including my advisor, which is like our little like study hall time, are all my internship. And that was for sure since day one because that's the only period for seniors. So that's how I start my day. So basically I go straight from my house to my internship. I might have to drop off my brother first, but, um, and then I go there and then on my way back, I have lunch. So technically I don't have to go back to school till fifth period because fourth period is my lunch period. And I can, if I'm not at school, like we can't leave. It's not an open campus, but if I'm already off campus, I only get counted absent for lunch. So I can go to like McDonald's or Chick-fil-A or something. And then I have first semester, I think I have Gov, AP Gov. And then second semester I'll have AP Economics those two are only half a credit each so I'll switch through those fifth period and then sixth period I have apes which is AP environmental sciences um, I got some chill teachers so that's good and then on ramps stats is seventh period I heard that teachers pretty chill and then I have English for AP which is AP lit and I have that with Caden so basically I'm excited but I have lunch with my little brother same lunch he's gonna make me bring him stuff every day and it's gonna be annoying but whatever gotta go see other people's schedules now <laughs> guys it's, it's a sad sad day sorry if you can hear that sound in the background my dad's fixing it um I got a package in the mail a Congress package which resulted in these which means is the day that I will be giving up my trusty pair of black coppers. Yeah. Oh well. It's kind of sad now. Because I almost wore these every single day. Like, for a year. The back of them is gone. I wear these to work. Now it's time for a new pair. I'm not going to get rid of these. I'm going to keep them. But like... Oh well. And then I have Sambas. Did I show you guys that? I don't know if I did. I picked up my first day of school outfit, but you guys don't get to see it. And then ugh, tomorrow's Meet the Bobcats, which I'll record like, getting ready, maybe some clips there. And then Tuesday, I might be getting my nails done. So if I do, I'll show you that. But Tuesday night's gonna be a different vlog. It's gonna be a get ready with me for the or, like, good night routine, school night routine for the first day of school. And then I'm gonna do another video, Thursday of school vlog. And then maybe next week like i'll do the first full week of school we can live but i need to start editing this if i'm gonna do all of that and then i don't know what i'm gonna do like you guys have to tell me what kind of videos y'all want to see this year because i'm opening a lot i'm gonna do getting my license because me and my dad were just talking about me taking my test in september <laughs> um yeah let me know i just woke up it's 11 and it's her last like summer day i'm not doing anything like fun I'm just going to like, I'm literally going to school today to go to meet the Bobcats, but I woke up to the smell of bacon. So that's great. And music playing. I mean, like somebody's in the shower, so like that's why the music playing. Like it's cool. But yeah, last summer day. Just tomorrow, like fully summer day. Just tomorrow, like it's still summer, but like it's a school night. Actually, I have no idea what time this is. I think it's like 5.20. And we, so basically I wanted to get there at like five. And so I was like, okay, let's like get there at five. <laughs> Hang on. So we meet the Bobcats and it says vendors open up at five, like food trucks, stands, sponsors, stuff like that. My senior shirt that I have to get for Friday because it's senior sunrise. Um, that's at, that starts at five. So I was like, let's get there early. Turns out. My brother does not have to get there until 6.30, 640. So we're not going to go early, unfortunately. 
but the pet bar only starts at 7 30 so we're gonna get there at 6 30 so i can see my friends get my shirt hang out because he has to be there at 6 40 so really don't have a choice so we're gonna leave in like 50 minutes so i'm gonna get ready now so i can just like chill but i don't know what i'm gonna wear shirt wise let me show you what i'm gonna wear that i know okay i'm gonna think i think we're gonna wear one of these tank tops so we'll see what looks cute with the skirt and if neither, then I can find another one. But like, that's a choice. All right, this is cute. Like, so I might try it on with jean shorts. Cause this is my this is my number one option. But then I just processed them. I see students there, and like, one of them's mom is an AP. So like, that's really kind of weird. <laughs> okay. Well, now. is lower so it's actually cropped it's 98 degrees outside so i'm gonna have to wear a tank top so i think i'm just gonna go with this one because it's full length okay i'm going with this i really wish i could wear my sambas but like we're gonna be on the track because students like high school students sit on the track um to watch the pep rally and i don't want to get it all over my brand new shoes so instead i'm gonna wear my brand new commerce <laughs> but it's okay i think i'm gonna try to slick back my hair for the first time like actually slick it back it's insane i do not go anywhere without this like i always have it on and i don't know why okay i have other bags i can put my wallet in but nope so i was editing just now before i realized what time it was and I didn't realize, like, I didn't know this because obviously I recorded it, but I did not know that I made a Nile vlog. So I've been like, oh, I gotta edit this before Thursday, but no, I can just edit a video that's already done because, like, I'm making clips now. And like, maybe a few tomorrow, but, like, not much because I'm gonna do a whole nother vlog tomorrow night. I'm just stressing over getting this entire video edited in two days. My hair is dirty, I know. I'm showering tomorrow, though. <laughs> Heidi. I was gonna say okie dokie, but I kind of messed that up. I'm ready. <laughs> and it is 5.37, so now I can lay in bed. But I can't because I'm here. So I can sit in bed. Guys, oh my god, so I just, I got bored. And I was writing my calendar, like, I was gonna just do, like, when I'm doing my nails, when I'm volunteering tomorrow, like, just, like, main things. And then I just kept going, and I, like, set up my entire calendar for like all night tomorrow so like it's like awful you'll see it in tomorrow's not tomorrow's video in the next video i mean not next i don't know in my getting ready with me also since this year i'm gonna try my very very best to pack my lunch as much as possible um because like i'm gonna have internships i can go out my lunch too which now I'm thinking about, like, I'm not gonna, like, every Monday at least I'm gonna pack my lunch. And that's my goal. So, I just, like, made a list. Like, I was looking on TikTok of, like, lunch ideas. Because I don't want to bring, like, a Lunchable and, like, a Dr. Pepper. So, I made, like, a list of, like, six different lunch options that I'm gonna do. So, I'm gonna start with, like, one of them. Wait, what am I saying? Tomorrow I'm gonna pack one of them. You can see which one that is in my night routine video. <laughs> Basically, I'm just saying you'll have to watch that after this mirror is absolutely disgusting but i changed my outfit because i put on these shoes and with that shirt <laughs> it's on the floor already with that shirt it just like looks weird with black shoes so i put on a black tank but it's like a bodysuit so i forgot i even had this otherwise i would have already worn it so yeah final outfit let's do a bit check so my hair <laughs> is in a ponytail and then i use that wax stick i just got it on amazon this necklace is brandy melville this one is i have no idea it's my mom's earrings are all from um amazon rings i my friend gave me this i think her grandma got her like a pack of them and she gave me the second one these rings the three gold ones oh wait i was trying not to flip you guys off i apologize those are all from target this is from target these jean shorts that i'm wearing are from american eagle and then converse I made this bracelet, it's also me and Caden's eyes. Don't know. Permanent bracelet from Florida. Obviously, I have a watch. I think that's all. And then, 
My bed is squeaky. I need to like, fasten those things. My Lulu belt bag, which looks better now. I need to tighten that. But I'm ready to go. We've got six minutes. Well, this is not what I expected to do tonight. I look like I'm crying. I'm not, I swear. Oh my god, I really do. I'm not. I'm just tired. My eyes do that when I'm tired because they get dry. That was fun. I did not take a single picture, actually. I mean, I did, but like, it's not like a picture picture. It's a point five of a friend doing something funny. But, oh my god, my eyes are really water. I'm gonna apply to some colleges. Wish me luck. I made a bad choice. Why did I slick my hair back and not shower tonight? Because I was like, oh, I'll just shower tomorrow. It's fine. Like, I'm fine with sleeping with it, whatever. Like, I, oh, well, I can get past it. I have places, like, I have things to do tomorrow. Like, I hope I can slick it back again. Also, this is, like, feels disgusting. I need to, like, brush it. Maybe it'll feel better, but, like, I'm gonna have to slick it back tomorrow again. Like, it's my only choice. And I don't know if I want to slick it back for school for the first day. I don't think I will. I think I will Thursday. But I think I'm going to, like, braid it. So then whenever I dry, like, whenever it's dry, I take it out in the morning. It's, like, curly. Okay, bye. <laughs> you guys can see, hear about this tomorrow. Hey, guys. It's literally over a week later, I think. My hair's crazy. I'm sorry. Um, it's not even late outside. Late outside? It's not even dark outside. It's not laid out, whatever. But I don't really feel like getting up to turn off the, or turn on the lights. Because I'm watching TV and editing. And I'm using literally, you can't even see the, the flashlights on. I'm using my camera's flashlight right now for lighting. But I guess I never did an outro for this video or maybe I just like can't find it. But yeah, um, the rest of whatever I filmed the next day is going to be in the next video that I'm actually going to edit right now. So y'all should go watch that because I've been in an editing slump and I'm getting it done today. Because I went an entire week without posting. I apologize already. But yeah. Thanks for watching.